Blessings on Safa Blessings. Welcome to Wallflower Healing. I'd like to thank you for choosing me. Today I'm back with a monthly message from my Libras. So whenever you watch this message, this is for you. Before we jump into it, Libra, I would like to say, oh, please take what resonates and leave what does not. But Libra, there's energy around you where somebody has their minions, right? Somebody sent all their little minions out to get something done and they watched. They thought they were going to get their karma. They thought they were going to get justice. And unfortunately, that justice was just a night. It was fleeting. It was, it was a, somebody won the battle. They didn't win the war, right? So now the, the commander, whoever sent these minions out, watched their defeat. Now the commander has to get into the war and get things done. You get what I'm saying? So now, how can I put this in levels for you spiritually? You're moving up a level. You, I don't know if some of you used to play Sonic, but in Sonic, you know, or in video games, you beat one level, you move up, but now it gets harder and harder. So somebody underestimated you. They thought that you were comparable to their minions, but now the coach, the leader, the, the guider has to now take you on. And this is really going to show who's big boss, who's the big kahunas around here. Because if they have to get into the war, who are you really? You get what I'm saying? Who are you really if they have to get into the war now? All right. Let's start with the message. Ooh, wee. <laughs> the nine of wands and the chariot flew out. So somebody's trying to protect their family. Maybe that's the reason why they're saying that they're doing things. They're trying to create, protect their home, protect what they built. Somebody's trying to create. So somebody's trying to create something and they feel like you're the blockage. Monthly messages for Libra, first week, second week, third week. Thank you, guys. First week, second week, third week for Libra. Monthly message. First week, second week, third week. This month is going to be a lot of working for you. The first week, all is clear, though. It came out with the Ace of Swords. Ain't no lies, ain't no BS. Nothing's going to fly. The truth is out. I also feel like you're going over people's heads to get the clarity, to get the truth. There's no more games being played around here, is what I felt like. Let's clarify the Ace of Swords for the first week. For Libra. The Ace of Swords. The Knight of Wands. So truth about somebody's passions, truth about somebody's infidelities. I feel like more so infidelity. It's truth about what somebody has been creating. I don't know. For some of you, you may want to be careful. Somebody could be. So you may need to go to the doctor. But somebody's burning bridges is what I feel like. With the three of wands. Like somebody is acting like they want to move with you, but somebody is a sabotager. So the first week, Libra, you're going to figure out who is sabotaging, who's trying to infiltrate your business, infiltrate opportunities. It's going to be so clear to you. The stars have aligned, literally. They have aligned. Your higher knowing is telling you, like you're getting major downloads and clarity about a way a person is moving, a way a situation is going to unfold. It's no more confusion here for you the first week. Now, the second week, since you got all the clarity, you move into Sagittarius energy. You move into harmony. It's all peace. It's all love. Like, all that ringing in your ears, all that noise that you were hearing, you get it now. You know you know why now. Clarify Sagittarius. I saw the Six of Wands. You're going to get offers. People are going to realize you're the person, your wish fulfillment, the Nine of Cups. They're going to feel a little silly, feel a little stupid that they left you out in the cold. They know that you have abundance. They know that you are the snake tamer. And they know that you are emotionally depth, that you can take on the world. 
somebody's gonna make you a big offer the second week. What I tell you, the star, you're gonna get big offer, big dough, big money coming, Libra. Big opportunity, major. Second week, let's go to third week. Could get a raise, a promotion. I really feel like it's a worldwide thing. An Aquarius is going to be mad. It's going to be jealous. A Leo is going to be mad. It's going to be jealous about what you're creating. How did you do that? Where was I? Why wasn't I included? Somebody's going to be real jealous. Like you're Moses. You're leading the way. You're leading the way. Somebody sees that you are a hidden gem, that you are a tempered gem. They're going to make you the offer and it's going to be over. You're taking over the world. You're taking over the world. Pinky and the brain. Now the third week. The Queen of Wands for Libra. The, t the Eight of Swords. So now that you're on this new mission, people want to trap you. People want to slow you down. You don't got everything that you... You got rid of the rats. You got rid of the snakes, right? No, you got rid of the rats, but you kept the snakes. <laughs> That's crazy. You got rid of the rats, but you kept the snakes because you know how to tame the snakes. You can make money off of the snakes. You know how to tame them, so you're going to work with them. But in doing so, somebody else is jealous of this new beginning, this this new fire. This, this You're going to be center stage. Somebody's mad about it. Mad about it. It's like a wolf. It's like a wolf. I don't know what represents the wolf, but I really feel the wolf, right? This person has set up a trap for you. But you recognize the trap and you want to take this person out is what I feel like. Six of Pentacles. Somebody, once you get this blessing, somebody's going to set up a trap for you to delay you. So then now, from you being on the top, now you got your hand out. Now you need something from them. You get what I'm saying? Somebody is trying to reverse the rules. Somebody is trying to conquer you because you are in your power even though justice didn't come out look the sun card i'm telling you somebody's trying to conquer you because you are in your power somebody wants to join your team they want to get down but they feel inferior which is crazy it's like if somebody wants to join you but they feel inferior you already know that i'm popping like how are you just play your position play your position that makes no sense yeah it, <laughs> the ace of pentacles play your position this is how they feel. They feel inferior. They feel like the baby to you. But let me teach you. Let me teach you. And then you can become what you need to be. The high priestess. I'm telling you. And then the ten of pentacles. That's the story. That's your monthly reading. So you're going down a path during this month. Libra full of hyenas. Full of people. Full of minions. The minions are out. All right, but it's because you're lying. It's because you know the truth. It's because you know where you're going. Don't worry about it. Look at look 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 where you end. You started at the six of pentacles. You end on the ten. You end on the ten. Because you start with the ace of swords. You start with clarity. You start with the six. You figure out who's who's slowing your six down, trying to bring it to a three, trying to mess up your connections. You're like, nah. Let me pray, let me elevate, let me cleanse my energy, let me get a line, because something's not right. Something's not right. Let me make some offers. Let me make some hidden offers. Let me make let me do let me move in silence, right? And then I could close out whatever this person is trying to create. I become the creator. I'm gonna create. I'm I'm in control of the situation. Let me dip. Let me hide out. And then pop back out. Could you go from the hermit to the queen of wands, then pop out. Fully refreshed, fully rejuvenated. Clarity, the Eight of Swords and the Six of Pentacles. People stressed, stress about your money, where you're going, people pocket watching, people counting your coins. But it's okay. It's okay because everybody knows you have a new beginning. Everybody knows you have an empire and everybody wants to be down. But understand that there's jealousy around you. There's a lot of jealousy around you this month, Libra. But what I got to say is trust your higher knowing. That's what this is about. Trust your higher knowing. Say less, do more for this month, Libra. Um, and what's the message from God? What's the message from God for Libra?
ask and it will be given to you seek and you will find it knock and it will be open for you clarity you opening up doors from the th from the three the six of pentacles to the ten of pentacles ace of pentacles with the high priestess and the ten of pentacles you opening up doors some of you a virgo is very significant with for you you may want to collaborate with a virgo or you you just want to create with someone in secret you found your harmony you about to create you about to make it happen uh an institution that you're working with there can be an institution that's trying to stifle you from creating this or the person that wants to work with you is a part of an institution and they they don't want to betray the institution there's some type of loyalty there's some type of connection this is that minion energy that i was getting in the beginning again like somebody is connected to somebody else Tell me more about what I'm feeling. The Ten of Wands. Justice. There you go. <laughs> yeah, and the two, two of Pentacles. Somebody's juggling. It's hard for somebody. It's really hard for somebody. Libra, this can be a Sagittarius that's having a hard time. I also feel like Libra, don't burn yourself out. You may be working a lot. Like time is going to be passing by. I feel like crossing the street is, is significant. So pay attention when you're crossing the street or something like that. Or you may be driving and somebody may be like crossing the street and they may be on their cell phone. Just be careful. Something with crossing the streets. I guess I have to ask you, this is so random. Why did the chicken cross the road? Judgment. That's the question I need to leave you with, Libra. And the Hierophant, I'm telling you. Why did the chicken cross the road? This is wild. All right, in the meantime, in between time, Libra, sending you nothing but love, peace, and light. Until next time, blessings.